you know, there's good days and bad days. Today was just a good day for me. So it was fun to come out here and finish a sweep. Uh, I think the night to night game gave a lot of us rest and we all felt fresh today. So I, mean, I definitely felt like that. And I think a lot of my teammates did too. How much motivation was there in having struggled against Washington the past couple of years for you in that particular night? You know, I really don't look too much in the past. I mean, there's certain instances we do, but there's definitely a chip on our shoulder from the way we played up there last year. So I'm very proud of our guys and the way that we came out and, you know, showed the way the Ducks can play this weekend. Three hits today. I mean, they, like you said, the ball's got to look huge. To you. Is there any one thing in particular that you were seeing just this series? I mean, it's incredible against Washington. Is there anything that you saw throughout the weekend, or is it just finding the ball? You know, baseball is a lot of ups and downs. And, you know, I've been in a couple downs recently. So working hard with Coach Wozniakowski and, you know, fixing my approach and getting back to where I need to be. And just kind of slowing the game down. This game got slower and slower as the, the ABs went on this weekend. And uh, today it threw out a couple hits to me. So nice what exactly was that change in the approach? Just, you know, being able to slow my mentality down and lining the ball up to the opposite field. I um, mean, I get pull happy sometimes. When I struggle, I pull off the ball a lot. So being able to get back to where I need to be and get the reps that I need to get and just get my, my mindset right for the game. You excited to go hit in Tempe a little bit easier to hit there? Yeah, you know, it's still baseball. They, they have a real good pitching staff. So, you know, it's going to be a challenge for us, but we're very excited for it. Ryan, uh, Georgia said that you guys aren't a team that's going to hit 330, but the way you guys have come out, a couple sweeps here, is that in a way feeding down to the offense and going to help you guys maybe get close? To that oh, de definitely. You know, our mentality on offense is win, and we've been doing that lately, so we can't really be picky and choosy, but we're definitely not satisfied with the way that we've been hitting, and I think that we're going to continue to get better. Um, you know, Coach Waz keeps telling us, keep working, and the game will find us, and I think it's definitely starting to find us a little bit. You know, nine hits, and you know, I think you guys got a glimpse of what we can be tonight, so and I think it will keep getting better. Are you having a Brett back in the lineup? Do you guys have an emotional boost or anything like that? Definitely. You know, great, Brett's a great leader on our team, very emotional, uh, vocal leader, and leads by example very much. So, you know, he's a great guy to have around in the lineup. But I think he's a lot more effective in the lineup than he is on the bench for us as a team with his tools and stuff. But, you know, having him lead off the game for us is a, a big boost for our offense, I believe. Pretty good efforts from the pitching staff this weekend too. You know, you can't complain when you got guys going out there throwing out, you know, ones and twos and zeros and pull uh, pull situation. But it's very, very fun to play behind those guys. Throw a lot of strikes, you know, and I think that it's just an honor for us to play behind them and have good first steps and make anything we can. It kind of keeps you on your toes when the guys are that sharp. I mean, the infield plays better. It just kind of gets you in the game more. It makes you want to play harder, get the best first step, you know, get everything you possibly can. I mean, you watch JJ play shortstop, and it's, it's impossible to get a ball by him. The same in the outfield, you know, if the ball drops, we all look like, wow, how'd that happen? Because we're just, I feel like when the pitchers are on the mound, we're just very locked into the task at hand, and we've been very good at that lately. Really. Calendar rolls over to April, about 30 games in. What's your gate? Have you been around long enough to kind of see how this thing works for the season? Will you see this team coming together? Yeah, I think we're we're really starting to put the puzzle pieces together slowly. Um, the pitching and defense has been there very much so, and the offense is starting to come along. Um, but not only the offense, but the hitting. Like we kind of separate those into two things. The offense is, you know, where you can execute, uh, hit and runs, bunts, and stuff like that. We're getting a lot better at those, but I'm waiting for the hitting to come around, and I think it's definitely getting there. Coach Waz is getting excited, and a lot of us feel it in our prep work and stuff and the new PDA. We just feel the excitement coming and the, the quality swings, and you can even see it. Our, our outs are getting louder and harder, so I think that's a good step in the right direction for us. Thanks, Ryan. Thanks, Ryan. Thanks, Ryan.